Hi viewers, welcome to Sabo's Kitchen. Today in this episode we are going to show you how to make eggless carrot cake. Christmas is here. Many people like to do homemade cakes. So this time I have come up with a little more healthier cake which is carrot cake. We are going to add lots of fresh carrots along with nuts and enrich this cake. Today I am going to make a double layer carrot cake with cream cheese frosting. I have made this little healthier by adding one proportion of wheat flour along with maida. Let's get started. Let's see the ingredients needed to make this delicious eggless carrot cake. First take a sieve and add a cup of maida and one cup of wheat flour. To this add a teaspoon of baking soda and baking powder a pinch of salt and then sieve everything together well twice. Now the dry ingredients are ready. We just need to add one last ingredient, the cinnamon powder. The cinnamon powder goes very well with carrot cake. So add a teaspoon of cinnamon powder and mix it well. Keep this dry ingredients aside. Let's prepare the wet ingredients. In a mixing bowl take a cup of sour curd Along with that, add 1 cup of granulated sugar and 0.5 cup of brown sugar and give a good stir so that the sugar gets nicely dissolved in the curd. Once the sugar gets dissolved, add vanilla essence. I have added a teaspoon of vanilla essence and then followed by the dry ingredients. Add little by little and keep mixing it until everything gets nicely incorporated. Finally, I am going to add a stick of butter which is at a room temperature. Mix nicely with a whisk. Now our batter is almost ready. We just need to add the nuts. I have added nearly 1 fourth cup of chopped pecans. If you like, you can also add walnuts or almonds. Give a nice stir. And now comes the final and important ingredient which is the grated carrot. My grated carrot looks absolutely fresh and very pleasing to the eyes. Mix nicely with a spatula and pour this batter to a 9 inch round or square pan. I have split the batter into two 9 inch round, square, round pan and baked it at 350 degree Fahrenheit in a preheated oven for 30 minutes. Bake it till the toothpick comes out clean. Allow it to completely cool for 5 minutes and then flip it on the cooling rack and allow it to cool completely. I am going to make a double layer frosting carrot cake. So I allowed it to completely cool off. If you are going to make a single layer cake, you can cut it and serve. For the frosting, take a mixing bowl and add 8 oz of cream cheese. To the cream cheese, add half a stick of butter with it, which is 1 fourth cup of butter and mix well. Add vanilla essence. Along with that, add the powdered sugar and beat everything well with a hand blender or a mixer or even with a whisk. Now my frosting is all ready. Take the cooled one cake and nicely apply the frosting on top of it and then place the other cake on top of the frosting applied cake and then keep applying the frosting on all the sides. Once you are done on all the sides, just using the knife we can make some pattern on the top of the cake like this and then if you want you can further decorate the cake by adding grated carrot all over the edges of the cake now one layer I have added the grated carrot the next layer I'm going to add the chopped pecans we can leave it like this this itself is very pleasing to eyes if you want, you can add slivered almonds also. Add some slivered almonds and finally, for a final touch, I am going to add desiccated coconut. Wow, this looks 
absolutely delicious serve this delicious carrot cake the cake is nicely spongy and the frosting has made it very much pleasing to the eyes appetizing and also it is very tasty with the crunchiness of the fresh carrot and the desiccated coconut along with the nut try this delicious eggless carrot cake for this christmas and share your experience i'll meet you all soon with another interesting recipe please subscribe this channel for more upcoming recipes thank you